crush on this guy. Home action. Almost got scammed, oh my goodness. Why am I marketing someone's products for them to make sales only for me to make no money? Doing amazing, sweetie. This looks so freaking good. Wins of this week. No spin January. Hello, my loves. Welcome back to another vlog. Why do I feel so freaking cute with a towel on my head? I just washed my hair. It's Thursday at 5 o'clock, 5 or 2 to be exact. This is when I'm starting my day. Not exactly when I'm starting my day. I already started my day. I've just been in bed editing the previous video. If you haven't already, definitely check it out. I am about to record some content and I'm like, I want to bring you behind the scenes. So I decided to turn the camera on. Start this video for those that are new here. Welcome for those that have been here. Well, welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. I feel the need to sing that song every time I say welcome back. But I have a video idea. This is it. Go, Kylie, go. Good job, Kylie. You're doing amazing, sweetie. I haven't uploaded anything on my Instagram, TikTok, or whatever, and I'm looking for the most lighthearted thing because a lot of times when I want to give value, I have to actually think and sit down and create. I'm not in the mood for that, but this is very lighthearted. I've been meaning to create more content where I'm promoting my journal, so I'm like, this is very nice and light. I'm not exactly promoting my journal, but I'm planning to promote it in a post tomorrow. But it's like I'm soft launching it, okay? So I'm going to do that right now. I'm wearing like three different outfits. I'm going to wear this shirt because I want to do like three different characters. Someone behind the camera like, oh, Kylie, go. And then another one saying, you're doing amazing, sweetie. And then me standing here doing like, you can't see me. Wait. Right here where the journals are just pulling out the journals. This character is not doing much. This character is just pulling out a journal while the other character Go Kylie, go! Right? <laughs> okay, let's do it. What I normally do is get my computer and open the videos. Like I've already saved them on TikTok and this process is very repetitive because it's like you're acting so I'm going to keep repeating this. Kylie, go! Go Kylie, go! Go Kylie, go! Until I get it. So I play it non-stop, non-stop. Until I get it right. Change of outfit, the behind the scenes you don't see you are on my chair right now. Because my tripod is not that long. But time for character number two to kick in. This is Chris Jenner. Encouraging myself to show up for myself. Is that background okay? Doing amazing, sweetie! Wow, look at her go! Go, Kylie, go! Good job, Kylie! You're doing amazing, sweetie! Wow, look at her go! Woo! Great job! Video recording is done. Now I have to call my friend because he sent me this package. He wants me to market it for him. I'm excited to create content for him, but I want to quickly introduce some... Whoa! My phone, damn. One of the things... I bought this microphone. You know I have a... a this one. Damn, the light is so hard. Wait. This microphone right here, I bought it because I wanted to start podcasting, but have I ever started? No. However, I told myself, well, not I told myself actually, why don't I give credit where it's due? I was talking to Izzy today, and one of the things I do a lot is rant. Like, I rant like crazy. So I'm going to start a podcast called Rants. So I'm going to rant about lifestyle things that happen, dating and relationships, finances, life, procrastination, whatever. It's just going to be rants. These runs are not going to be an hour long, at least from the start. They're going to be about 20 minute runs. And I'm just going to invite a bunch of people that I know to come on and rant with me. So if you enjoy my YouTube runs, you're going to really enjoy this. I'm going to do a listening podcast, but I'm also going to do a YouTube podcast. So either way, you guys are going to see my rants. It's just not going to be vlog style. It's just literally going to be me sitting down and ranting. That will be it. So get ready for that. Get ready for the tea, 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 tea. Oh my goodness, you guys, it's 5.47 and I don't feel sick. We did it, but now it's time to take our vitamins because I think the only thing that's helping is because I've been taking my vitamins actively. So let's go. This light is so bright. Oof, can you see that difference? Damn, that's the difference between my ring light and no ring light. In terms of vitamins, I do vitamin C, magnesium, but I didn't work out. I normally take magnesium when I work out because it helps with bone strength. But I'm going to take it now because I've been having some knee pain. Vitamin B12 and vitamin D because we don't see the sun. And I realize that that's probably why I've been very like sickish in the evening. Because I don't take enough vitamin. Because I'm lacking vitamin D and also iron. I'm not eating my greens. And I realize that when I don't eat my greens, I'm just a little bit off. So we're going to do greens. 
about Brussels sprouts and asparagus two videos ago. Do you think I've done anything with it? Even cauliflower. And I hate when my food goes bad. I need to be better. And yet every day I'm out buying food. You know that I told myself right now, what do you want to eat? You should go out and buy something. Why? Why when I have food in my house and I'm not eating it and I'm becoming deficient? That water almost missed my mouth. I don't want to put my lipstick on the thing, but why? It's my drink. Mm. Last but not least, vitamin C. This is a chewable. Oh my god, my video has been rejected. Apparently there is copyright sound, but I uploaded this, vid this same video on YouTube Shorts. And the sound wasn't copyrighted. That is so strange. Oh my god, I just clicked a key that was at the bottom here and it's something called the flip side dam. Can you see? Focus on my phone. Welcome to the flip side. Be yourself in a new space just for you and your friends. Only choose the people who can see this side. Guess what time I'm finally getting out of bed? 4.15. I know I might say something like this and it seems like I've been doing nothing. I haven't been doing nothing. First of all, <laughs> Talk about that first one. Ouch, did you see me? This is why I say always tag the brands you want to work with. Then Bobby Tab tagged me today. You know, one of my goals is to not check my phone for one hour, but as I get my phone, it had died. I put in the charger, and then guess what? I see a notification Bobby Tab repost. Do you know what it means to be reposted by a brand? I really want to work with Bobby Tab, and the fact that I created this content from an authentic place. It's been a month. I uploaded this video on 29th December and today is 26th December. Sorry, today is 26th January. This is when they are resharing it. Yesterday, their brand owner shared it on her stories. I'm like, <laughs> I'm doing something right. Anyway, I've spent the morning applying to brands and I almost got scammed. Oh my goodness. Okay, I don't know if it's a scam. Let me tell you about it and you tell me in the comment section down below if it is or not. So, I want to work with brands, so naturally when I see creators or brands that want to work with creators, I'm, I'm very curious to apply. I applied to this one, it's a jewelry brand, uh, whatever, it was so quick, like in less than 30 minutes I got a response, they told me that I will read it for you. Of course the one thing that excited me the most, I'll tell you what it was. I, sent, I, I took a screenshot and sent it to my best friend because I'm like, this cannot be for real. So they sent me back this whole thing, how they're doing an ambassadorship and I can choose three pieces of jewelry for free, but of course I have to pay for shipping. By the time you choose three pieces of jewelry, your $200 is out, right? Their jewelry is about between 50 to 80 bucks, 80, 90 bucks. So this is USD. So they gave me a code and I did the code. Of course, everything is free, but I have to pay for shipping and the shipping is like 60 bucks if it was you. This is a product you've never used before. You, you don't know if you can trust them. Would you pay the 60 bucks for shipping to get a $200 off? And I went to TikTok and I started doing research. I'm like researching this brand. Have they worked with? Who have they worked with before? I don't know if the lighting is good. It looks good here, but when I'm editing, it kind of sucks because it's going away right now. They say here the packs, you get three free items. You get 30% commission if I recommend it to you. But here is a thing. Do I want to recommend something I've never used just to get my money back? I don't know how I feel about that. And then they said they will pay me. They, they're not directly paying me, but I can make commission. And for three to five pictures, I get $500. Then they have this monthly $1,000 giveaway for um, top ambassadors. And when I went to look at the creators, I feel like I can be a top ambassador real quick. And then they have this get a chance to win a full expense trip to Hawaii, Palawan, and... The Maldives with three thousand dollars pocket money. Of course, when I saw that, I'm like, mm, girl. I didn't think about it until I checked out, but now I've had time to think about it. I don't know if I'm going to take it, but I'm going to do some more research and see if it works out. You guys, I know I look ashy. Okay, let's just put that out there. I know I look ashy. I'm about to walk out because no excuses. I didn't walk out yesterday, and I was here scrolling on Instagram. Then I saw someone go like five out of five days walked out. I'm like, don't get out of bed, go walk out. My house is a mess from yesterday when you saw me creating content. I didn't put anything back, so I'll put it back right now. Workouts, 
and we'll see what we're going to do for today because the day is almost over i'm only going to create one piece of content that i should have gotten up and created also i wanted to make a video for you for i know i'm all over the place but then i realized i want my bathroom doesn't have the best light so what i want to do is get a light buy a light that i can put like you know these tiny ring lights and like a suction cup that i can put on my bathroom mirror so that i can able so that i can be able to do all those nice bathroom videos with nice lighting right i found a nice one and of course i'm going to share it with you guys once it arrives tomorrow but guess who is going ice plunging tomorrow i'm talking too much let's just walk out and we'll catch up every time i try to yeah, but how good do i look I'm sexy and <laughs> Casa, okay, my house is your house. Today we're making pizza. I want to make cauliflower pizza. Friday nights are normally extra special because it's the end of the week and because we are doing no spend January. It's not like I'm not spending. I am spending. I'm just being very mindful with my spendings. I'm spending less. Also, when I say I'm being mindful, it means I'm spending like normal because this month I'm using the month of January to learn my spending habits. So that's why I say it's no spend January, but I am spending. I'm just being very mindful, buying things like I normally would, but not taking Ubers for no reason, you know? Huh? Anyway, let's do it. I'm also going to have a little naughty drink. It's just freezing. <laughs> I don't know why I whispered. I think this should be enough. Will it? I hope so. One person? Maybe not. <laughs> oh, this is so big for my hand. This thing is so big, we need to cut it. Time to squeeze out this bad boy. I'm African, I keep all my hands in my oven. But my butter is dying. No freaking way. We didn't miss much. Pizza crust is ready. And instead of pasta sauce, we are going to do ground beef. There's tomatoes and everything, so that's the sauce. I got the sauce. Who got the sauce? I got the sauce. Yella, let's play. I was craving pizza, so I made this amazing cauliflower pizza. All you need is a cauliflower grated, or if you already have cauliflower rice, cook it a little bit with some salt. Let it cool. Time to squeeze out this bad boy. After squeezing out the water, you're going to add one egg and season it to your liking. Garlic, oregano, ooh, salt, pepper, cheese. Add it to a parchment paper, flatten it, and then bake it for about 15 minutes at 400 degrees. Then make whatever toppings you'd like. I just made some ground beef and topped it up with parmesan. Pop that back in the oven until the cheese was melted, and voila, it was so freaking good. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Let's pretend I know how to make a fancy cocktail, okay? Frozen glass is the tip to make it look nice. Cute ice. Damn. Even after such a hard beat, it didn't come out. Perfect. This is our shaker. There is sparkling water in here. So let's not shake so much. Shit, I don't have mint or basil. Mm. 
and that's a cocktail. Cheers. Oof. Oof. Strong. Just waiting for the cheese on the pizza to melt and we'll have dinner. Oh damn. Oh damn. Need some color. You gotta admit, this looks so freaking good. Dina! I forgot to do a taste test for you. Ah, oh, so good. Mmm. 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 Damn. You know this is all mine, right? Oh mine. Oh mine. Oh mine. Oh mine. My favorite winter activity is ice plunging. I say it's my favorite because I hate winter, but it's the one thing I look forward to. I thought that this winter I would get myself an ice bath and put it at my balcony, but this January started with no spend January, so unfortunately I cannot get myself an ice bucket. <laughs> but I can go to the lake and join the other people doing the ice bath. Oh my goodness, I just realized I didn't shave. As I talk to you guys, I need to shave. <laughs> no, I need to share because when you enter the water, you don't want your hands to go so you're like, and, oh my god. And I know it's a bunch of hippies, <laughs> but yeah, because people say this is hippie activity, so I shouldn't feel self conscious. But where I come from, Chevy, well, that's how I've, you know, that's how I've been brought up. I have an idea, I had an idea. I remember that I had this, so I'm, I'm going to start using it for my. <laughs> Gin. If you live in Montreal, you know what this is. One of the best. Ooh, clubs, clubs, clubs. I know why I'm doing my skincare. Because I'm about to go and not look cute. Also, my former crush is normally at these ice sponges. I don't know if you'll be there today. Anyway, now I'm in a different mental space. I don't know why I felt the need to tell you this. I, because I don't crush on him anymore, but here's the reason I started going to these ice plungers. You see, the things boys make you do. I went there because I'm like, oh my god, I have a crush on this guy and I wanted to get to know him better. And I did. But you know people who you like on the internet, but in person not so much? Okay. TMI. Damn, I like this moisturizer. It's giving. I don't care so much about how I'm dressed for this because I'm always too cold to even care. So I'm wearing a swimsuit, this shirt. I'm going to wear my hoodie and sweatpants because you have to wear big clothes. By the time we get out of the ice, I'm going to try and record for you. But I think I shared it in this video over here. You can't feel anything, you're numb. And yeah, I also want to record a video for, oh shit, I just remembered Steve Madden, my boots, because I'm going to wear them today. And yeah, damn, I'm seeing a guy running in shorts outside, so it's probably not that cold. Well, it is to dip your body. But yeah, um, let me clean my boots so that I can record some little footage. I have a crazy idea for an uh, ad for Steve Madden. I check their page. I do this thing whereby if I love a product, I just create content for the brand just to put myself on the brand's radar and just give like my honest, authentic opinion. And this, these Steve Madden boots, I love them. I bought them a while ago and they're wow, they're amazing. I've worn them for so long through all seasons with all outfits, party outfit, sweatpants, work, everything, and they still match with everything. So I feel like I can create some good content, tag them so that they can notice me, then I apply to work with them. Anyway, I'm going to be late. Look how my pants just came out of the dryer. <laughs> wow. And I'm going to wear them like this. So here is a, let me show you what I pack. Them, underwear, no, I'll go commando. I'm just going to take this dress. It's it's easier to change. Leg warmers. A took a neck thing. Extra pair of socks. Cloth for the ground. Towel. And that's about it. Oh, tripod. <laughs> and gloves, of course. I still have the mess from last night, but ignore it. Last but not least. One drink. I put clothes. 
We need to add some honey and cinnamon. Okay, I'm late. I'll see you there. We are here. I haven't gone in yet, but I think I should go now. Nick's got some hum action. Wow, that was so good. It's so sad that I can't go to the sauna right now. I tried to go and fix my key. I just came from Canadian Tire. They said they can't fix it, but my landlady said I should go there to get a battery. So I guess I need to contact my landlady. I'm going to take the longest hot shower. Edit this video so that you're able to watch it tomorrow. I also have to do a weekly review and I cannot wait to show you. I'm doing much better this week than I did the previous week, so I'm proud of myself. I also wanted to start a reward system for myself. I'm still figuring out how to do that. I don't know if I've already asked you guys before, but if you have any tips, let me know in the comment section down below. How do you reward yourself? I would really like to know. I'm working on that, and I think I'm going to be so huge on that next week. This week, I actually took time to write all my wins. We'll get into that tomorrow. I need to take a hot shower right now. These are my confessions. I'm wearing the same shirt I was wearing last night. It's 3.07. I'm about to clean my apartment, but I'm like, damn, will I get a chance to record this before the daylight goes away? Also, I want to edit this video before I start cleaning my apartment and upload it because we are being consistent, okay? Yeah, I would normally wait till I'm done cleaning. I have a clean apartment. I'm all together, but I'm like, why? So I went out last night and I want to discuss my wins of this week. One of my biggest wins this week is as part of my goals, I wanted to meet more people in the content creation world and all them things. And last night, I went to drink with someone I met on TikTok, which was so great. I think we clicked. I think it was really nice. I don't know if she enjoyed it, but I did enjoy meeting her. So yeah, it's nice to make new friends in the content creator world. Yeah, that's a win for me. And I also want to be in the habit of celebrating my wins. Like I told you earlier in this video, I'm still looking for ways to reward myself but I guess last night was a reward going out to meet a new friend is a reward to me like going to drinks and everything when I reframe my mindset it is a reward I met someone and we had drinks we had a good time having a good time is the reward for all the things that I achieved last this week this week the owner of booby tape reposted me booby tape reposted me on their page ah, guys look what I woke up to look Oh my goodness, I've been reshared on booby tape. I love booby tape. And for them to repost me, I po keep in mind I posted this in December. This was for my Christmas party. I told myself I'm not supposed to check my phone when I wake up, but I saw this notification and I'm like, girl, you're tripping. As you can see, I'm still in bed. <gasps> A win is a win. I'm reading from my notes because I didn't want to forget any of these things. I'm going to keep a running list of this so that it keeps reminding me like, oh my God, you did that, you did all these things. Because we tend to forget all the good things that are happening for us and we, we keep chasing something. We are like, oh, I want this, I want that. And not stop and think, oh my God, all these cool, amazing things happened for me. And then I did that in Jala Nails ad. I don't know if you watched the previous video, but I did an ad for a friend of mine so many inquiries you know what that tells me it tells me that my content is very engaging that means brands would benefit from it because i have proof for all the things that i'm doing okay that's a win for me i didn't make money but the fact that i can prove that i can make money for brands that's yeah that is a win i started a partnership with good food i'm so excited for that i'm supposed to receive the package today however i think there was a problem with my order so it's probably coming on wednesday but i started a partnership with good food and i'm so excited for that i marketed my journal this week intentionally twice so that is a good thing i didn't get any journal sales however i got two inquiries which that is better than no inquiry at all i'll just tell you that i'm in my gratitude and receiving error i'm not in my complaining error i went live once and in that live one girl said i inspired her so much to start a content creator journey 
that is a win for me yeah that's it for my wins this week i'm so proud of myself i just want to remind you if you're watching this and you're a content creator or you're on any journey that sometimes you might be looking at the wrong metrics like oh my god i have very low views but okay so what if you have very low views are you getting something out of these low views because for me i might have low views but those low views are targeted views i don't know if that makes sense so i'm grateful for that and for the habit trackers oh my gosh i've been tracking my habits all week let's see last week i was at 5.7 completion rate oh, i was 43.5 Last week I was at 5.7. I'm becoming better and I'm here to encourage you to do a tracking system for yourself where you track how much work you're putting in. Because I stopped focusing on the results and focusing on how much work I'm putting in, the results are starting to manifest themselves. And I guess that's the whole point of this video. Oh my god, another win that I forgot to write. I didn't know how to charge my friends for my services. Earlier in this video I told you I was going to create content for my friend. I learned how to charge my friends. I was so bad at charging my friends for services because I felt like, oh my God, I need to give them this service for free because they're my friend. But why am I marketing someone's products for them to make sales only for me to make no money? Does it even make sense? No. And now that I'm saying it here, yeah, that's a proud moment. Anyway, I'm talking too much. I'm going to go ahead and leave you guys. I did this video, clean my house. Get ready, reset for Sunday because you all know Monday is my favorite day of the week and I like to get ready on Sunday. I hope you enjoyed this video. As always, do not forget to stay motivated, be patient, trust the process, spread the love. I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Mwah.